Hello everyone, it's Anna here. I'm a Wakelet ambassador and a Wakelet community leader as well. In this video, I'm going to show you how it's easy to activate Wakelet browser extension, where you can find it and why it's a good idea to start using it. So uh, you can go to wakelet.com and scroll down till the keep the content that matters title over there. Here you can see that there is Wakelet browser extension and you may choose, uh, depends on the type of a browser that you use. Actually, I'm using two of them. It's Google Chrome browser and Microsoft Edge browser. So all you need to do is just click on this icon. So after clicking, I'll be thrown to Chrome Web Store. Here you can see that icon activated because I'm using the incognito feature. Let me but show you how it's easy to uh, find Wakelet Google Chrome extension the other way. So if you have already created your Wakelet account, it's really easy to find uh, the activating option for Wakelet extension. Simply use Google search and type in Wakelet extension. After that, you are going to be brought to this page. Just press on Wakelet Google Chrome. So here we go. We are in Chrome Web Store. You need to press on Install button. So after clicking the Install button, you're going to be asked for permission to activate this Wakelet extension. All you need to say yes and to edit and to make it active this way. And here you're going to be asked to choose one of the two view type of the next open view tab on your panel of your browser. For instance, let's have a look how it looks like if we use the view number one. Okay, so when we click on the plus button over there to open a new tab on the panel of your browser, you can see that every tab, they are pretty much like bookmarks. And we can drag each of these bookmarks or tabs and add it to a certain kind of collection that you have already created. Or you can add this one uh, to your items like bookmarks. So um, you can use also group collections and add this tab to any of your group collection where you were invited. Okay, let's move back and have a look how the second type view of the tabs are going to look like. Yeah, I know there's so many words of tabs. Oh my gosh. Okay, so keep your current tab. It looks uh, like before the Wakelet extension, like you used to uh, see your new open tab. But um, I really like got used to the Wakelet extension view number one because it's really great. Every time when I open a new tab and all of the tabs that I have already opened, I can add this one to any of my collections that I've created. So I'm using my another account for demonstration only and that's why I'm having only two collections that I've created. So in my main account there are like more around 200. Okay, every time when you're not feeling like really cool about this extension, you can uh, find out how to disable it and to move back to view number two. So if you are not sure, you just uh, click the button done and stick to one of the two types of the view of your tabs. So, but I prefer this one. Click the done button. After that, every new tab that you're going to open in your uh, on your panel of Google Chrome browser with Wakelet extension is going to look like this. Oh, now you see that the Wakelet icon has appeared over there and it's really great. Every time when you need to um, fulfill your collection with a new item like a bookmark or a tab, you can click on this icon. You can uh, stick it to your panel over there. It's not stick, that's why it disappeared. So you can easily go to your uh, settings of extensions and click on this button and uh, like stick this extension to your panel on the browser so you don't need to go and search for it. You can also click on the settings and uh, work out your extensions when you click over there, you can see that you can disable each of the extension that you have in your Google browser or any other browsers that you use. 
okay, you can just remove it or you can uh, press on uh, some detail, more detailed information. You can set the settings. You can, again, turn it off by clicking on this button over there. And yeah, that's pretty much, so it's really easy to use this extension. It's really easy to choose one of the two view types of your tabs. And I think it's really great. And one more great feature about using Wakelet browser extension. So when you go to your Twitter account and you look at the area below of your tweet, you may notice this beautiful Wakelet icon. So when you click on this, you can save any tweet to your bookmarks. You can save it to any collection that you have already created, or you can even put it inside of a new created collections. So also you may add this tweet to your group collections uh, in which you were invited uh, by other users of Wakelet. And also you can edit the topic, like the main description, uh, by whom it was tweeted and also you can see this icon in the responses to your tweet oh my gosh this is so amazing and really helpful i really hope you enjoy watching this video and if you enjoy it, click the like button and i suggest you to start using wicklet extension for your browser because it's really helpful and a good time saver stay safe and blessed see you in the next videos bye